hey loves welcome back to my youtube channel so if this is a little bit weird i am recording off of my phone right now my daughter lost my charger for my camera so i digress but literally every time i try to become consistent on youtube something happens my battery goes missing battery charger tripod whatever but anyways today i'm going to be doing what's in my diaper bag i have yet to do this and i now have a newborn again so I wanted to show you what all I have in the bag and you're not really going to see anything containing anything pertaining to my toddler just for the simple fact of she's at school five out of the seven days a week. So really we only pack things in there for her like if we're going to going somewhere on the weekend and she also has her own little bag. But anyways, let's get started. <clears throat> So this is the diaper bag that I am using. This is the Sarah Wells pumping bag. So if you followed my what's in my hospital bag for my baby, you saw that I was carrying another Sarah Wells bag, but this is the one that I'm now carrying. This is absolutely beautiful. I love it. I also have a matching wet bag. And then on their website, they also have a matching um cooler so like for the bottles they have the matching cooler and then they also have like the matching bra um pumping bra so it's awesome but i absolutely love this bag just like the one i showed you on my what, what's in my hospital bag there's so much space in here so many compartments and i love the fact that it's a backpack um i don't think i'll ever go back to handheld bags ever again diaper bags i mean but diaper book bags are the way to go. So let's get started and open this bad boy up. So we just got home from being out, so my bag is a mess, but let's just go ahead and open it. So first I'm gonna open this little compartment right here. I don't think anything's in there. A shopping list, y'all. A shopping list, okay, let's just stuff that back in there. And then there's a little zipper part right here. Let's see what's in here. It's my key from Universal Studios. This can't get any more real than what it is. So let's open it up. Um, once I have everything out, I'm gonna show y'all what the inside of the bag looks like. So the first thing you're gonna find in my diaper bag is a nice burp cloth. Um, KJ is now at the point where he is starting to teeth. So there's a lot of drooling. So this is very, very necessary. Next, I have my sunglasses. So this also doubles as a purse. I do not carry a purse when I have a diaper bag, with, when I have the diaper bag with me. I also have my headphones and apparently my husband's headphone, headphones too. I have my wallet. And then I also have a bottle with some milk in it. These are one of the bottles that we are using. So this is the Dr. Brown four ounce bottle. And then I have the formula. So typically I'll either use our um, formula dispenser, which I cannot find, or a sandwich bag if I do need to take formula with me, but I just put it in here because we were rushing. So we do use the Infamil um, Neuro Pro to supplement whenever. Um, and just, just to talk about this really fast, the only time I really supplement, supplement is when he just absolutely doesn't want to latch or, um, that's pretty much it or something's happening and I really just need to feed KJ but for the most part he is a breastfed baby. I also have a bottle of water so I would use this for myself if I needed to and then also for his formula. I always have an extra pair of socks. Um, this is the diaper cream that we use. This is baby butts cream. We got this from his doctor's office so this is what it looks like inside. We haven't really used it as much. We also use A and D if it comes down to it. This is a receiving blanket that we use. So this is from May and Joy. I am going to link it down below. I love this print and design on here. I have an extra little outfit for him. An extra Dr. Brown bottle cap. I have his cute little sandals from Old Navy. I mean, like literally, y'all, how cute are these? I have my spritz. This is a thousand wishes from Bath and Body Works. And then I also carry an extra pacifier. So he's down here if you're wondering. So this is the pacifier that we have been using since he was born. This is the Smilo pacifier. We love it. And then Dr. Brown also sent us some pacifiers. So we use this as well. Um, luckily, he pretty much adapts to anything. So this has been working really well with him as well. So I love to carry an extra one because... KJ loves his pacifiers. So this is what the inside of the bag looks like. It's kind of messy, but 
In the back here, there's an extra pocket with zippers. And then there's an extra, extra pocket back here. And then you have these two pockets up front. So let's go ahead and go into the two pockets up front. I have my Honest Hand Sanitizer Spray. I absolutely love this. It's really easy to just use, especially with children. If I need a spray mason, just put it together. Um, it's a little bit more easier than just pouring it in her hand. I also have my lotion. This is the Thousand Wishes Lotion too. Okay, and I think that's all I have in those pockets. Okay, so now to the back part. I have this baby bum, um, I don't know what it's called. I am gonna call it Rash Cream Spreader. I'm pretty sure that's not what it's called. So it came in this little case and I love this, especially when I do have nails or you just don't want extra gunk on your hand. You can just easily, let me show y'all, just easily open it up and then spread it where it needs to be spread. So it works really, really easily clean hands love it and this is the mini they also have a full size as well and then also in the back i have his gripe water dispenser for some reason his gripe water is not in here but i always carry that with me it's it works it's a lifesaver definitely have it if you need it um i have a pen and then i also have my nyx lip gloss and some deodorants so in this back pocket here I have y'all I'm just showing y'all what's in my dirty diaper bag I have a little note from Crackle Barrel when I work with them I also have a little bit more information about where we stayed when we went to Universal which is the Cabana Bay Hotel and yeah that's it so let's just go in this back pocket just more notes y'all a letter from Y Hotels when we stayed there, and then some bills. So I also wanted to show y'all what's on the side of the bag. So there are two side pockets. This is where I store diapers. So let me just show y'all the diapers. So I have two types of diapers. I have, I have Huggies, and then I also have the Parasol diapers, and these are size ones. And then I also have wipes. Right now we're just using the Kirkland baby wipes. Um, we purchased from Costco. And then this is really important as well. I have KJ saline nose drop. So he can get really nasally. I don't even know if y'all can hear it, but most of the time it sounds like he's like congested. He's not sick or anything. His doctor just recommended that we use the saline and like use nose the nose Frida frequently. Um, well not frequently, like daily, just to get him cleared out as well as a humidifier. And then on the other side of this diaper bag, there is like a little pocket right here when the bag is properly packed i'll put that um not wipes i'll put the bottle right here and then there's a little pocket so for those of y'all that are not into backpack style you can also carry this strap style as well so that's some of the reason why i love this bag but yes that is everything in my diaper bag if you are interested i'm gonna go ahead and pretty much link everything i think y'all would want the links for down below in the description box. I hope you all enjoy and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye y'all.